Hey guys, I'm Lyle and welcome back to my channel. This is just a quick video to touch base with you and set the stage and some future goals as to where we're heading with this virtual lab building series. So to recap, over the last seven videos, we've been building a lab around the fictional company Morgan Maxwell Real Estate. We looked at the OpenSense firewall and I've covered the installation process the setup of Suricata's IDS and IPS features. We then continued exploring the web filtering and proxy configurations, and also showed you how to configure high availability using COP and PFSense, as well as multi-WAN failover and load balancing. Finally, we set up OpenSense as a next generation firewall using the Zen Armor plugin. If you haven't already, please go check those videos out. So to continue the series, we're going to cover both blue team and red team operations. For the blue team, we're going to be setting up a security operation center, abbreviated as a SOC. And in our SOC, we're going to configure Wazoo as our SIEM or security information and event management platform and collect threat and vulnerability information from our endpoint virtual servers and clients using the Wazoo XDR, which is an extended detection and response agent. Secondly, we're going to look at the Hive, which is an open source security incident response platform or SERP. And we will integrate the Hive with Wazoo, which will allow us to track any potential security events that we observe by opening cases against these events logging all of the observables and artifacts and assigning tasks to the analysts. The Hive in a nutshell is basically a case management system for cybersecurity analysts. Thirdly, we're going to look at Cortex, which is an observables analysis and response engine. And Cortex is integrated with the Hive and it allows us to feed all of our observables that we collected from the security events which then gets analyzed, compared, and shared against services like VirusTotal or MIS, which is a malware information sharing platform. And based on this intelligence that we gather, we can then determine how to respond to the security event. Finally, we're going to look at how we can automate and orchestrate certain tasks within the SOC by utilizing a SOAR, which stands for Security Orchestration, Automation and Response, to take some of the load off of the analysts and essentially avoiding burnout. Moving over to the red team operations, we will set up Caldera, which is an automated adversary emulation framework created by MITRE that gives us the ability to imitate an adversary and to test the security posture of our endpoints against common hacking techniques contained in the MITRE attack framework. In addition to this, we'll also use Kali Linux and its tools to simulate various attacks. In this lab, our endpoints are going to be a Windows Server 2016 Standard Edition, which we'll set up an Active Directory, Domain Controller and DNS Server on. And we'll also set up an Ubuntu server, which will host a website and various other services. And finally, a Windows 10 Pro desktop, which we'll attempt to exploit. All these endpoints will have the Wazoo agent installed and will be reporting back to the seam. My final goal of this lab series is to show you from both a blue team and a red team perspective, how to attack and defend and ultimately improve the network security posture of this fictional business. I believe that setting up a lab like this will bring you as close as possible to real world scenarios. And with these skills and concepts that you learn here, you should easily be able to transfer these skills with minor adaptions to real world scenarios. For this lab, I'm going to be building it using Hyper-V. However, with minor adaptions, you can follow along using VirtualBox or VMware, or even set it up using your preferred cloud platform. If you've enjoyed this video, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell so that you don't miss out on any of the videos I'll be releasing to the series during the coming weeks. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys soon. Cheers for now.